Kazi down ta up to right things we Nyad za juu zese na retief ndai chid we Kana mchida o tipi za deep ndai pid we Make you spill a bean if you know what I mean Hande It's time! Ladies and gentlemen We're back. The Denny J Show. Becky is here. We've got a very special guest. But we're going to introduce him in a couple of minutes, right, Becky? Yep. We're definitely going to introduce him a little bit later. There's some things that we just need to get out of our chest. Order and sort it out. No, we're not fighting with anybody. Calm yeah, down. yeah, we're good. Yeah. Yes. We're good. Um, <laughs> so, uh, Nash, are we chilling, man? What's good, Denny J? What's good, Bex? Chilling, What's man. What's good, Chilling, Chally. chilling. Are you behaved today? Because... <laughs> <laughs> okay, Becky. You're, you're starting with me. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're, you're throwing bars. No, I'm not. I'm <laughs> just checking on him because... I mean, previously on the Denny J show... <laughs> um, um, there's, there's a guy who, who, who came in the comments and wanted us to shout him out. I, I didn't write him down. Um, what do, I, do got, you? Wait, I got him here... Hopefully, okay. Yeah, usually on point. I scrolled way, way too much. He was right there. He's like, hey, give me a shout out. Mm -hmm. We're going to give you a shout out, man. We have to stop everything. Make sure you shout it at, shout it out at. Yeah. How, do you mm -hmm. say it? Yeah. How do you say it in English? Shout, shout it, it out, out at. English, yeah, I got a good thing. Gerald Mapie. Yes. What's up, Gerald? Mapie, what's popping? What's good? Yeah. Thanks for thanks you know for showing us in mm, Africa. Thanks love. for watching the show. Yeah. Show love. Um, today we have a very special guest, like we said earlier on. Um, mm. He is like a beast on these streets, on these R and B streets. Is he an Afro? Afro? No, I think you literally just gave it away when you said R and B streets. I mean, there's Trevor Dongo, there's uh, there's uh, Takura, there's there's a lot of people on these Takura streets. Takura is under R and B. Yeah, R and B and hip hop. He, he oh, raps and he sings. He's like Drake. Oh, okay. Can sing and rap and, and all that good stuff. Uh, so what we wanted to talk about first uh, was the issue of the gold coins, right? Please. I believe they're coming out 25 July. Yeah, that's like next week. Yeah. Uh, so a lot of people are confused about how these uh, coins are going to sort out our problems. But Danny, being Danny, sorted us out and that's he right. said... I got you. And and uh, Nash, you wanted to say something about the people who keep coming in the comments and, 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 and saying fact check this, fact check that. A lot of stuff that we speak about, sometimes we can even speak about stuff we don't know. Yeah. But we, we don't claim, about but we don't we claim, don't claim to, to know it. because yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot of I mean, this stuff is opinions, right? I was being right? told about research and everything. I'm like, That's a big research. This is, we just here chilling, you know what I mean? Yeah. If, you are, if you want, you know, proper yeah. facts, yeah. please feel free to news channels, yeah. news channels at 8 o'clock news. Mm -hmm. Mm. And, uh, and and more serious outlets. We just thought you chilling. Yeah, and and also I think for us we just start the conversation. Yeah. So you can Google further, and you can, and it's also cool. You can actually also just like comment. Fill us in on you can actually just like comment proper. as well on the on the in the comments and the tell comments us. Yeah, this yeah, like is there actually was one like this gentleman that. who commented on the bill on the row versus yeah, whatever, and he gave us a whole. Yeah, Bible. And I'm thinking you. Bible of everything. Yeah, but that was insightful. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, very, yes. yeah. Thank you for that information. We, we love it. We love to learn. Sure. Um, so, yeah. So, what we're going to do is now we're going to call a professor. Yeah. Because we couldn't count on Becky or Nash to oh. tell us about gold what coins. Do we know? Nash? Because these people know nothing. <laughs> so I mean, Becky thought we were going to go with the gold coins to the shops. Yeah, but actually, you can. Uh, uh, go change. Good I don't know. Yes. I don't know. It's complicated. They but done a gold coin that I get it two thousand. Yes, but lucky money bag. Yeah. Lucky for us, we have uh, Professor Gift Mogano. Yeah. Can you just tell us a little bit about the professor? We're going to put him on a on a three way, and he's going to tell us. All right. So coins. Professor G uh, Gift Mugano is a Zimbabwean academic, financial analyst, and economist. He is the former Zisco Steel interim chairperson. You know how big Zisco yes, Steel yes, yes. is. He, he was really, he was really there. Yeah. So he's quite vocal in terms of um, getting people to know right. what is going on in terms of um, money and the economy, right. the state of the economy in Zimbabwe. He is, is an expert at the Africa Economic Development Strategies, and he's also, he's also the director 
right. of the Africa Economist Development Strategy. So we are not nice. just talking to anybody. Yeah. He is more than qualified. To more than qualified to tell us how these gold coins are going to work. What what, what does it mean for the everyday person? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and those in business, especially for those in business. Yeah, like so what does that mean? All right, so we're connecting the professor now. Connect the professor, Jenny. Um, you should be on in a few seconds. Hello. Good afternoon, Professor. I'm, I'm, how are you? I'm good. Welcome to the Denny J Show. It's uh, it's very nice of you to take our call. Oh, oh thank you. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Yes. Uh, the gold coins. We just keep arguing about stuff we have no idea about. So we wanted you to mm-hmm. uh, sh- uh, give us some insight on um, on how they're going to work and whether you think they're going to work. Why were they introduced? Yes. Okay. Uh, that's a very good question. Um, look, I, if, I, if you follow what the governor of Central Bank has said uh, in their statement, right. uh, the, the argument is that uh, they've introduced uh, gold coins uh, to provide an alternative vehicle uh, right. for value preservation okay. without uh, um, going to, the, to buy foreign currencies. Okay. Uh, I think the the rationale has been on the realization uh, that uh, people are buying foreign currency to preserve value. Yeah. Because the, the Zimbabwean dollar has become useless. Right. Uh, people cannot hold va- a value uh, in the Zimbabwean dollar. Okay. Because the role of man is to is to be a store of value. Right. And the, then it can be accepted as a media exchange. So right. in this instance. Uh, the Zimbabwean dollar can not fun- perform that function of storing value. Right. Right. That, that is the rationale, the way they're coming from. And if you follow again, when the governor was speaking in parliament on Monday, he, he reaffirmed that, and he is of the view that uh, the rates are going to fall. Now, that is his view. Okay. Uh, what is my view? <laughs> exactly. I was yes. like, okay, that's your view. Okay, what's your Yes, what's your yeah. So, because it's important for us to speak from a police perspective, what are they trying to achieve? Now, for me, we need to understand there are two categories of, of uh, economic agents here. Okay. We have the households, the individuals, you and me. Mm-hmm. Then we have the corporate. Those are the two clients for the gold uh, uh, coin. Right. So when you look at uh, who is participating on the black market, it's so all of us, the corporates and the uh, individuals. So we within individuals, we have 49% of the population in extreme poverty. They live on less than a dollar per day, right? A dollar ninety cents per day. <clears throat> they also have seven eighty percent of the total population uh, in poverty. These are not in extreme poverty. They live on two dollars or so per day. So when you look at a gold coin, gold coins are a form of investment. They are an asset which you can invest into. Right. And the basic economics tells you you can only invest to many savings True. because savings are identical to investments. So how do you expect the majority of people, which include the people in the informal sector, people in the working class who are in poverty, how are they going to be able to put money aside to buy gold coins? Now, if you take the price of gold per ounce right. of about $1,800, for example, mm-hmm. who is for that money? Right. Mm-hmm. Now, that's number one. So the answer is no. Then secondly, assuming I win a lot as a person and I, I, I Maybe I, I get a trip as an employee. <laughs> I got some money. Right. I buy gold coins. Right. Now I fall sick. I want medicine. I need five dollars. Yes. But in the meantime, my money is tied in gold, which is uh, custodial services in the bank. Even if I'm keeping it under the pillow, how yes. can I cut it into small pieces which can give me five dollars? Right. Right. You see what I'm saying? Yes. So the, the issue of divisibility becomes the real issue. Right. So why would I trouble myself if I'm a Zimbabwean with gold? Yes. At the end of the day, what do I want? I want the U.S. dollar. So, so why can't I just keep the U.S. dollar? And keep those under your pillow. And keep those yeah, under my pillow and don't even pay services or custodian services. And, you know, so those are the issues. But there's one big elephant in the room, which I want to, I know you, you are oppressed with the time, which is in the room. Right. The issue of uh, arbitrage. Right, right. I, yeah, I, wa- the, I wanted to dwell on that, yes. Because there are so yes. many rates in the market. Exactly. So let's take two rates. The interbank market rate of now 
three night uh, somewhere there, uh, and the the black market uh, rate of uh, four hundred eight hundred eight hundred eight fifty. So, yeah, yeah eight fifty. So the black market is two times higher than the official rate. Right. right. So what these guys have done, they've really created another market for corruption and arbitrage over and above the existing on of auction system. Right. So the, the the real cancer happening in the auction system is is just the same cancer which is going to be happening mm. on the gold coins because those who have the money now, the corporates, which are what you're talking about, mm-hmm. uh, and the, even a few thieves who are getting contracts, what do we under what do we call tender for new ones? Right. Uh, they will be able to go and buy these gold coins um, using. Uh, mm. Adel, 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 interbank rate, interbank rate. rate. Yes. Then they they sell the gold sixty US dollars. Yes. You know. And before all, you know it, they yeah. change it into black market into other TGS, the market market they are back again. And then they keep going. Yeah, yeah. like rates. They will be running like rates, going up and down. Yeah. So does the gold coin have a particular value that one gold coin is equal to? I think it's one thousand eight hundred. They're saying. The speculation. Yeah. Uh, this go, this, this gold US. coins are, are sold per ounce. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So it it now depends on how many gold coins are going to be in that tray, but they they in troys, T O R Y, they in troys. Right. So more like okay. a, so so for, for them to make them an ounce, it's one thousand eight hundred them there. Okay. So if yeah, so that, one will buy them equivalent to about nine hundred and start them one thousand eight hundred and go back and buy two trays. Wow. Um. Mm. So you have no confidence at all in 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 the gold coins as a store of value. No, they they they, they can't be store of value. Because those who are supposed to be not participating in the black market are out of the market for the gold coin. Uh, we have 7.9 million people in extreme poverty. Right. We have 20% of the population, which is close to um, 11 to 12 million people in poverty. Right. So they can't buy gold coins. But those people are buying gold right. currency. Because if you get your salary right now, mm-hmm. you can buy $10, you can buy $20. Okay. It's very convenient. And you continue to remain on the black market. So, so, so this gold coins are going to have fundamental phenomena of failure. All right. So wow. what does that yes, mean yes. for the average person in Z- in Zimbabwe? It means yeah. more poverty. It more means poverty. More poverty. More, oh. more poverty. Because when you are creating more distortions, oh. you are creating a more casino economy. Right? Wow. Uh, there's no economy which can f- produce and create jobs when there are arbitrage opportunities. Why would you want to go to the farm and produce when you can buy gold coins and in two minutes you have double price? Go back again and go and buy again. Why do you go to production? Why do you create jobs? Wow. It means more, 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 more exchange and volatility. I said this when I was, the, and people never understood me when the auction system was launched uh, in July 2020. I was very clear that it's going to fail uh, because the very same reasons which uh, the interbank market has failed then were the same fundamental reasons which I was believing. So if the auction system failed to work because there was no uh, pri- effective price discovery where the rates are market determined, mm-hmm. in Zimbabwe, the- oh, we got wow, power. yeah, network network is bad. Wow, but uh, that's the professor. Uh, wow, he just got cut off there. Um, do we need to reconnect him, or we got the fundamental? Um, I, th- I think I think I think we're good. Yeah. All right. Uh, yay. Well, wow. thank you, Professor, if you're watching this. Wow, we're wow. Trying to connect. Uh, that was Professor yeah. Gift Mugano. Um, sure. And uh, just just tell us what he is again. So, we, you know, we we, we, we get <laughs> perspective. Uh, he's very confident. Hello? Sorry, we had, we had got cut off there, Professor. The yeah, that's case. fine. So, yeah. I was saying that the challenge which we have is that Zimbabwe is running what we call command exchange rate. So, okay. And now we're trying to copy a model which has been done in South Africa, in Australia, in UK, in America, where they use liberal economics. Uh, the you, you let the economy, the exchange rates are not manipulated. When you land at South African airport, you can see the exchange rate on the screen uh, floating up and down. In Zimbabwe, you are given the rate of a week, you know, wow. in, the, in between now and the other seven days, you're on a pause. Wow. It doesn't work in okay. uh, in economics. So so the gold coin works in in every market, even in India. But here it doesn't work because we have exchange rate uh, 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 
differences between the former and the black market trade. As long as those rates uh, are different, it doesn't work. And finally, as long as poor people are in poverty, they don't have savings, then we can't buy gold coins. Who would think about investment when I can't go to hospital? Are you saying when you I go, won't can't use go to the gold coins if so, they come So through, in conclusion... Professor? In conclusion, Professor, what what do we need to do? How do we get out of this mess? How do we solve uh, the problem of of poverty and 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 inflation and 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 all the stuff? How do we solve it? What is the solution? Yeah, it's a very fundamental question, a very important one. Uh, the challenge is that um, what 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 we need to do is that we need to have a national dialogue. I always believe that um, at this stage now, Mtuli cannot do anything. I think he's run out of ideas. His two boxes are empty. Uh, so what needs to be done is national dialogue. In Malaysia, let's look at examples. Uh, the Great Langawe Dialogue is called the Great Langawe Dialogue, which was held in 1995. Uh, it was because Malaysia had challenges. So they sat down, they discussed, because now our challenges are now more faster than now. Uh, Zambia also had its own national dialogue where they went out and they prioritized 10 sectors and they brought them to three sectors when the culture fell some years back. So why am I, why am I saying this? Because our challenges are no longer economics alone. Yeah. They're now also political. So if we want to look at this issue from a, a blingard approach to say we can solve this by now, say let's be productive. How can it be productive when you have no capital? Where have we lost capital because of poor brand equity as a country? Why have we lost the brand equity because of politics? Uh, so we need to have, have a dialogue as a Zimbabwean where everyone is in the room, where we have proposals for economics, which is production, current issues, the market-led economy. We have a, a paper on constitutionalism, we have a paper on politics. When I say this, people say I'm talking politics. But I'm telling you, because in the economy, economic, economics, there's also political economy to what is happening in the economy, mm. right? If we don't do that and have one team called Team Zimbabwe, right. we'll never achieve anything. And um, why am I saying this in my last comment? Remember, our challenges began 1997, 14 uh, November, on the Black Friday, when the Zimbabwean current dollar crashed. Why did it crash? It was not because of economics, it was politics. We had given war of veteran money, responding to political issues. We went to DRC, 1998, responding to political issues. 1999, MDC was formed. So from there, we've never had a peace. So okay. as long as we have no political solution. All right, okay. And, and the economic solution, we will continue for the next Yeah. All right. Thank you very much uh, for your insights, Professor. We appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank you. No, thank you. Okay, okay. bye. Wow. Okay. That was uh, Professor Gift Mugano, a PhD. Hmm? He wow. knows he, he knows his stuff. Uh, he's also the director at uh, AEDS, which is the Africa Economic Development Strategy. Yeah. That was a handful, right? It yeah. was. It was well, a handful. But you know, even after that whole explanation, those gold coins are coming. Yeah, they are. And people I, I, I are going to have to find a way I think so far to the, get their hands on So far, the, the two economists we've spoken to, Dr. Chanakira and uh, Professor, they all seem to um, agree that political risk is, uh, is our major problem. So, uh, and, and the same thing that he said, that, you know, we need dialogue. Yes, it's the same thing. Dr. Nigel said yeah. the same so thing. So hopefully uh, people are listening. Um and we I don't know. We just want solutions. Here. We just want solutions, right? We don't care how they come up, but we just want problems solved. Yeah. I'm yeah. sure by the time we do the next episode, Undi Giroka Gold Green. Yeah. Because I know you're going to get So, Nash, are you going to get some gold <laughs> coins? Definitely. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. So, yeah. So, guys, uh, you know, there's a lot of talk about these coins and, and whether it makes sense or whatever. You know, I, I think... Uh, there's different thoughts on it, right? There is, especially with the numbers that he was bringing up, the 49% in poverty and those still in the working class and still yeah. considered poor. Yeah. I'm just the gold like coins are out of reach of for most people. Just That's generally what it is. Um, yeah. Only people with like proper money uh, are going to be able to possibly profit from them.
because the issue of arbitrage will always be there for as long as you have uh, different exchange rates. You have a, an official rate, you have an interbank rate. So depending on your capacity yeah. to get uh, 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 Zim dollars, you can actually buy these coins quite cheaply and sell them off expensive and make a killing while at it. And the cycle continues. Yeah. So I, I, it will be interesting to know what, how they, they, they have uh, mitigated against that. The governor. And, we and, shall and, see. And, and, 2,500 and should come and Yeah. I think that's so much. That's too much knowledge for 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 one day, right? <laughs> what is your brain overload? <laughs> Nash, that's that's enough knowledge for today, right? Yeah, Tabo. Tabo don't bother. Yeah, I didn't get the album. Is it the chicken man? Yo, information so. overload. All right. All right. So Becky, Becky is gonna <laughs> is gonna put us on, right? And and tell us. No, but you you were doing it first. What was I doing? I mean, I, I, we are. Aren't you dropping a beat first? Yeah, yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah, I am, but you're going to, I thought you were going to talk first and tell us what's happening, who's this cat, and what have you, or, 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 or we just, we just go straight into it? It's okay, I can tell you who the cat is yeah. without getting into, like, yeah, serious the legendary. detail. The legendary uh, Dr. Love. Uh-huh. The advocate <laughs> of love. Malume. Malume. No, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Amba malume, amba. Yo. <laughs> give us, give us that laugh, Becky. <laughs> Don't be shy. Mm. <laughs> All right, you move away from the mic. It was coming on strong. So he no, is. In this instance, he's not the Malume of love because <laughs> Malume was just wrong. You know, like the, that, that, that whole angle, that yeah. dive night, was, it was ended before. Um, but Malume, um, ah, yeah. It ended before he started. It was late. Um, so this young man is um, a Zimbabwean uh, from Gweru, the city of progress, born in November 8, 1991. Right. <sighs> Th- that makes him 31. Are you going to pick on him also? No, 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 no. All right, no, it's cool. Um, he's a Zimbabwean R&B artist who was mentored by Leonard Mapfumo. Of the Seiko fame. And the sea and the Okay. Um, his uncle, Toxon Banda, played for uh, rock jazzers, a band from Malawi in the late 70s. He also played with Marshall Munumume before he left for Malawi, where he later changed his name to Mishik. Uh, mm. Dengwani to Toxon Banda. Um, his father, Godfrey Dengwani, was an acoustic performer in Libya and Mozambique, where he was training to be a pilot. Um, he's got his uh, education. We can't wait already, man. Who's, Hold who on. Are we talking about? He's got his education. <laughs> Shit. Because, because most people just think these people right. just come in oh, 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 on the mic and then there's no you know, information in between the ears. No, this one has got information in between the ears. Right. Um, has a city and guilds and hexo ICT diploma. So, Je Tech Tech, mm-hmm. it's his. It's okay. um, his uh, discography is. Uh, from 2016 right up until now. Obviously, it needs to be updated. Becky, what is he going to tell us now? Are you telling us everything, bro? No, I'm just, I'm just <laughs> telling you. I haven't told you the names of the singles right, or right, anything, right. all right? But he is the advocate of love. He is Dr. Rudo. The complainant says they have a computer in the building. Yeah. A second call says they uh, are being yeah. attacked. Yeah. Every available light side, light this bitch out. We're taking on AK 47 fire from out the uh, front of the synagogue. Big gap, put a crown on my head of rhythm and blues. Cause everybody knows I deserve that, and everybody knows I can have that, and everybody knows I can tap that. Look in the mirror, I see what I saw. Nasha uh, David is in the building. I'm oh. there to the top non-stop and everybody knows I'm hot. 
<laughs> I was hoping you're gonna do that. <laughs> Ooh, shit. <laughs> oh, fire, bro. You know, you know where your biggest fans, right? Really? Me and Becky. Yes. Right, Becky? No, definitely. Yeah, I can tell. Where did you, you get all that information from? Uh, uh, and Becky yes. knows everything and everybody. Wow. Uncle mm. Google, <laughs> Malume. What's going on, my man? I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good. Gweru's finest. I'm great, man. I'm really. Mm. I didn't know. I, uh, a lot of people didn't know you're from Gweru. In fact, he just came like a few years ago. Yeah. It, I, I figured. Even people from Gweru don't know. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? That's like. Uh, We're Gweru. That's like people like Buff. <laughs> who blow up in South Africa and then they have to then reintroduce themselves to us. But you, you guys, because I'm it's only like y'all. him, he came, he, I totally know blow, he blew up, and then my face, I got no oh, but that's our guy. Yeah. You know? Which is but, also but, good. But he, he's doing good. He's, he's doing good. He's not doing good, he's doing great. Okay, I take that back. He mm. is doing amazing. That's right. He that's is so doing much. a great. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes. Thank you. So let's talk about the journey. Um, how did this whole music thing start for you? Well, uh, music is sort of like hereditary. She she already explained. Yeah. Right, right. yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's it's a hereditary thing. It's 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 a family thing. Right. So I think I'm the one who has who had the audacity to say, okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm not gonna do anything else. I'm gonna mm-hmm. do this. Yeah. Most of my, my my family members can sing. My sisters can sing. My oh, yeah. cousins can sing. Everybody from my and family the dancing. Can sing. Yeah. Oh. It's, it's there. How come you know featured your sister or, or, or these other peeps on, on some of your songs? You, f- you featured a sister or something on any <laughs> one of your songs? They're not that good. No, they are. <laughs> <laughs> some of them are actually better than me, but it's just that they're not. They don't have the same energies I have into in coming into it. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Right. So uh, for them, it's it's like a church thing. They want to sing in church. They want to sing. And for you the were Lord. like, "Inini." That was my baby. I twerk. Well, my no, tunes. no. <laughs> Not necessarily. I'm gonna preach about love. I'm gonna sing about love. Yeah, I mean. uh, yeah. but so. the new song is like really killing it on these streets. Um, that Ikoko song. Um, it's but, not but called this guy, Ikoko. It's called Ikoko. What's the song called? <laughs> no, <laughs> it's called Ikoko Top Top. Yeah, it's called Ikoko. The challenge has a different name, maybe. You were telling me what the challenge is called. Yeah, you got top, top, top. Yeah, top, top. That's yeah, the but, the, but the song is called Ikoko. If you go on IG and look for the song. Yeah, I was looking for the top, challenge. Top. I did I did yeah, hashtag top, top. Yeah. Ikoko, I got nothing. So you could be right. The, 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 the so what's the name of the song? I put the, I, Well, I put everything into it. <laughs> That's the reason why I put everything into it. Because okay. yeah, people think it's called Top Top. Someone mm-hmm. would think it's called Ikoko. So I put it all together into one so that the okay, algorithm... Okay, so if you search Ikoko and you don't find it, search top, 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 you'll find yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Um, no. And, and cool. you started uh, at you started music uh, when you were still at church, right? Yeah. That's no. Well, or before then? Or t- tell us. Where, 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 where did uh, if, the if, urge to Yeah, if you ask my, 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 my schoolmates by Churchill, they didn't even know I sing. They're actually shocked that I sing. But you were you were you were you were in in these variety shows at Ruzi. No, that was that was after. At, at that was after. Well, that, I after only did one one cultural net show, okay. and everyone was amazed. And then it was like a like a like a buzz for like two three days. But this is you were like what form from what? I was form three by then. Form three. And okay. how big did your head grow? At that time. Mm-hmm. Well, I was by Churchill, and at the time, Churchill was like the high school that everyone was saying. And then oh my they've God, got this guy now who... Yeah. There was a time when Churchill was... Churchill, was Churchill, I, was, I was about to say no. that. Churchill oh, has bleh. never been cool. Bleh. Churchill bleh. has never been cool. <laughs> Churchill been okay. Y'all hate Churchill, it. Churchill, <laughs> Churchill was okay, 78, you know what I mean? 79, uh, 81, uh, 82. Just like P.E. <laughs> yeah. used ah, come to be on. Churchill has school. never been cool. No, in my days. No, but there was a time when Churchill was all right. Oh, was okay. Oh, right. Yeah, in oh, the right. 90s. In the 90s, in the yeah, 90s. 90s. Ah. Late night, yeah. Nah, but Churchill was not. Ah, yeah. hey, Churchill. So in the early, in, like in the 2000s, <laughs> Churchill was not? Never, never, never talks. Really? Churchill. Right, guys, How don't. old are you guys? <laughs> <laughs> oh. What was that? 
What was that? <laughs> Thank you, I, I, say, I had to say my but, school. But, yeah. but it's I been a while, man. I know you're representing <laughs> for Churchill, but yo, Churchill. Hmm? How old are y'all hmm. people? Yeah. yeah. So there we go. Uh, you in form three. Then you yeah. sang at this cu- what culture night? Yeah, it was a cultural night. Right. I remember I sang that song, that Jay Holiday song. I put you to bed. bed. Mm. Yeah, and everybody was like, wow. And the chicks, the chicks. Exactly. exactly. You know, in form three. At form three. He wants to put chicks to bed. Huh? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Come on, that was the hit song. <laughs> 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 that was the hit song of the time. <laughs> I was like, okay. ah, no, let me just try this. You know, yeah. I did it, and then everybody was like, nah, he's talented. But then I went back to the sports because I'm a sports person. I was a sports What person. sport? So was cr- I, I played cricket and rugby. Mm. Yeah, I rugby, think yeah. more rugby. More rugby. I more rugby, rugby than cricket. Yeah, yeah, cricket. Yeah. Yeah. I was actually, yeah, I was actually really good in cricket. Like okay. what, like mash good? No, like Zim cricket good. Oh, for real? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Shit, okay. that's good. Yeah, I was actually good. That's cricket, right? The rugby. Yeah. In, uh, rugby nah, rugby. Yeah. Nah, rugby. I was like, 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 I Mm. Ah, I, 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 my way. I was bad. And you were like, bad. that's it. Yeah, All right, I so throughout high school, that was the only time you performed? Yeah, that was the Before only you time actually performed. knew that this is what you wanted to do? Yeah. You All know, right. Yeah. So, so you noticed the talent, but then you just sat on it? At that kinda, yeah, kind of something like that. Because my dad was like, right, that's the other thing. Mm. Mm. My dad was into music. He would play the guitar every single day. Right. But he would tell me, focus in school. Do you play? Yeah, I play. It's a, okay. Focus in school. Mm-hmm. Do you read on my book and stuff like? He was which is the it. right thing. Yeah, mm-hmm. he was mm-hmm. totally against it. So at the time, I was like, okay, let me just do uh, what my dad wants me to do and get this, get these papers and get my education sorted. Right. And I, I'm happy. My, yeah, I know my time will come. Mm-hmm. Then I was just patient and stuff. Right. Yeah, but then I, I, it became you know like everything. I wasn't happy. Right. I wasn't happy and I in the room not debisa man. They can go on a change soon did I need a lot of change because not debisa. Mm-hmm. And I was like, nah, you know what? Let me just try it. Let me just try it. Let's see what happens. You know? Right. And there was this talent sh- search show that was going on in Guero. And I, I remember I specifically told the lady that was sitting by the door mm-hmm. was actually registering us. I told her this as as soon as I went to the table, I told her, I am coming to take your money. Oh shit. <laughs> uh. And then okay. I did. I did take their money. Yeah. And then they took me. This was right. a talent show in Guero. No, it was a, like a like, like a, a national like a national talent show. Dream Stars. Dream Stars. Dream Stars. Yeah. 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 Tell us about that. Who's who's behind Dream Star? What is the story with Dream Star? Dream Star is like a like a like a um, like a partnership of a, a lot of corporates, Chinese community, Analena yeah. Mapfumo, and National Arts Council. Everybody's just involved in mm-hmm. that. Right. And uh, they were doing this this talent search show around the around the country. And by the time to 2015, Dubana joined, and then, you know, I, I and then they were like, nah, you know what? Little Mabfumo hit me up. It's like, no, there's something more to you. Oh, mm. wow. I was like, uh, all right, cool. What does that mean? Um, we want you to work with us and stuff like that. So, so Little Mabfumo is with Dreamstar? Oh, yes. Oh, right. Yes, okay. He is. Nice. Okay. He's, he's one of the founders of Dreamstar. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah, but he's based in the UK or somewhere. Now? Yeah, he's based in the UK now. Oh and right. after that, it's like uh, I just asked, is there money involved? Because I just wanted to pay my fees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to pay my fees. How much? How much? How much? Right. How, much how much? And then they told me, I was like, ah, dope. I can pay my fees. I can finish school. Mm-hmm. Dope. So before Dream Stars, did you know Leonard Mavumo? Yeah, I did. He listened to his yeah, music listen to and his everything. Music. The, yeah. Who else would you listen to? Uh, Rocky, uh, Steve Dongi Makoni. Marshall, I'm I'm a little bit old school. Like okay. I, I I listen to the old cats. Yeah, those are legends. I yeah. mean, my, my lyrics are got deep. I think that's where I get deep lyrics from. Because okay. I also I always used to listen to those old cats and their lyrics and stuff. And yeah, that's where. So I your from. singing style would say is influenced by Steve Dogi Go. Okay. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> but a modernized kind of Steve <laughs> You don't do that storytelling. No, that, well, that dude was a storyteller. Yeah, it's, it's, it's called folk, contemporary folk music. But mm. the lyrics, mm-hmm. the delivery in the lyrics and how deep they are, right. that's where I got my art from. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. All right, so Dreamstar happens. Yeah. What was that journey like? Because I know you're not with them at the moment. It was amazing. 
Ah, it was amazing. That was like that's when I actually started feeling like I'm actually living my life now because I was mm-hmm. alive. The thing, the things, the area of my gifting was working, and I got to get out of the country a lot, traveling a lot, money. The mo- the <laughs> money part is nice. Yeah, yeah. I think you're one of the nice. fewest artists that actually is saying good stuff about nah, the, the money part was I nice. the money was yeah. bo or yeah. is you know. bo was it but, bo but or is it but bo? remember it's because of this this is like a, f- a well funded um yeah but he's not with it. them anymore yeah. yeah but i'm saying they 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 took him to china like six times yeah six times he, the guy <laughs> <laughs> but i'm saying like when you when you're singing to chinese people like yeah. they be bouncing to the well like, that's oh. this is the thing in china you can imagine the kind of love that... I'm, try, I'm trying to understand. Okay. The Let me just go go the Chinese cats. Go, 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 go. I mean, that's like later well, on. No, right? but, no, no. But back... <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm, Nash, aren't you seeing a Chinese cat? Tiki Taka. They dance with Tiki Taka. Okay. I want to put it like this. Imagine um, Jay-Z in Zimbabwe. I know. But it's English. It's English that's, or English. That's what black... Artists are in China. That's how big we are there. Okay, like yeah. that. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'm telling you, we're that big. Until that big, like uh, until there's an like, outbreak of some sort and they start treating us like yeah, shit. of course, yeah, 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 of course, yeah, of course. Of course. You yeah. are the cause of it. Okay, anyway. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, so you got there and they really accepted your music, whether they understood what you uh, were saying or not. It was. I would sing that Moyo Muti and people. I would it's see a people black crying. boy, man. Yeah, which one's that? Okay, do a verse now. Uh, Let, let's see if Nash will cry. <laughs> Nash won't cry. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a, it was one of your earlier yeah my earlier yeah. songs. It, so so it's 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 it was a great experience. I don't want to lie to you. It was right. an amazing experience. It was an amazing experience. And now we're here. Um. So if it was that amazing, what happened for you to then leave? Because I believe you were signed to a record label. Um, from Dreamstar, yeah, yeah. Mm. J, J what JCM JCM mm. I wouldn't call it leaving as such because if you say leaving, it's like see how like an ex or something. No, yeah. I mean it's like <laughs> you I left. Mean, you know, it, it's, it's doesn't matter if Mace leaves Bad Boy Records. Mm. He it's left. gonna make news, right? Uh, you our, left. our relationship was elevated to the next level. You know, mm. you still have a relationship. Yeah, yeah. Just to dope. Be he's being diplomatic, right? No, like for real, we have a dope. Elevated to the next level, baby. Mm. We're actually working together. I know, know I know, but I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, so it was one of those things where you agreed that uh, for for me to grow further, you've done this thing. They yeah, yeah, you gotta do yeah. The next painful thing. agreement. Okay. Because I'm go. loyal to them. I'm very loyal to them. Mm-hmm. They are the, they are the ones who made Nyasha David. You get what I'm saying. So I'm mm-hmm. very loyal to them, and they also think Kuti. They know their contribution to who I am now. So obviously, as soon as I'm going to work, I'll find and you, you still work with them on some projects? Definitely. Um, I will never stop working with them. Who, who, whom are you currently recording with? Now? Yeah. Uh, independent? Well, I'm independent. I, I record with a lot of uh, producers. Ikoko, I worked with uh, Rodney King Shizu. That's Jao um Oh, producer. okay. Yeah. Right. That's the one I worked with. So I was by MTM when I recorded that. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. You have a number of, uh, of reggae sort of songs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you did something with uh, Denroy. Yeah, uh, from the Morgan Heritage family. Yeah, right? yeah, I did, I did. How was that? How was that experience? That was amazing. It was an amazing experience. Trust me, it was. Yeah. Just, uh, they have this, um, uh, the agent of theirs from Uganda mm-hmm. just called me. I was like Nyasha with an accent. The accent is yeah, she's very fun. Mm-hmm. But she called me up. Ha, ah, uh, Papa Denry Morgan wants to do, you know, something with you. How did they I'm hear like, about you? How did they know that there was a Nyasha David at this point? Right. That this is that, that's a very tough question, because I feel like, uh, uh, what can I say? Say it like it is. I don't want to say underrated. Mm-hmm. I feel like Zimbab- underdog. No, no, not underdog. Zimbabweans just like sort of like stare at my work, right? Mm-hmm. They say, "Ah, oh, he's very good," and then they skip. They jump on to the next thing. Why is that? But then other people from outside mm-hmm. actually say, "No, but this guy is." Really good. Let's do something. Yeah. So BBC One Extra called me, and then they said, Ooh. "Yeah, they, they they said they're doing a documentary about true love, right?" Mm-hmm. And then they heard a song. They can't hear what it means, but the feelings that they're getting from this song. It one of your shona songs is Moe right? right. right? Mm-hmm. And then we want to do a documentary. So can you please explain it to us what it means? And then I explained. It was like, yes, 
please can we work with you and then we started working on a documentary of a couple in Tanzania mm -hmm. right. and uh, that went out that was big outside Zim right which is fine you get what I'm saying that yeah. was good that was that was really dope and then after that that's when they found me after that's they saw the documentary yes from Tanzania oh, wow. and then Papa Dinore Morgan and the Ugandan agent what is this documentary me. what's it called we need to yeah, we need to look it up. What is it called? It's the, it's, uh, it's written in Kiswahili, man. And some man's it. Yeah, it was All right, you remember I'll you, you give it to yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll definitely. Yeah. I'll check it out. pin the link on the comments. All right, great. Yeah, definitely. Wow. So after that, then they called me up. It's like, nah, nah, we love your voice. We want you to work. It's like, who, who are you? And then, <laughs> and then <laughs> it was right. like, no, Papa Denry Morgan, Morgan Heritage. Was like, what? Okay. Mm -hmm. And then, um, what's his name? The older brother, the eldest brother, Gramps. Gramps Morgan, was like, nah. My, um, I, I don't know how to mimic his accent. That's a Jamaican accent. It's, it's Give it a try. That's like proper patois, huh? Mm. Yeah, my youth. I was. And <laughs> do you know what? Do you know what's okay. funny about those people? I like <laughs> those people. They can just start praying in the middle of a conversation. Praying? Yeah, praying. Like he's talking, my son, and then he starts talking about the beard of Aaron and the anointing flowing down to the garment and jar Rastafari. <laughs> like, what? Look at Nash's mm. face. <laughs> <laughs> <What>? <laughs> And yeah. it's like, no, I love your voice, my son. Gigi, let's do, let's do. And Gramps is on the line. And then they talk, start, we start talking. And then we make the preps. We record the song and boom. So there was no communication breakdown in, in terms of accents and everything. Because most people... Yeah, I had to listen really carefully. Okay. I had to listen. Record that really shit, like play back. Like, yeah, what did I had to really listen. And I had to also skip through the prayers. Because... <laughs> <laughs> It must have been a lot of otherwise friends. you would have lost it yeah, you would, would have, have just like okay it. now you are so um, hey, emperor hail is the last you know and i'm like oh, okay so it was a dope experience i enjoy that so they they were they were recording in in america at the time and i was i was actually supposed to go so that we record the video right but then covid i had the invitation letter i had everything i had to go oh. and then covid struck uh, struck and then i was like ah oh, no it's cool but then they push the song. They really push the song. Mm -hmm. Outside Zim, mm -hmm. that song is big. What's the song yeah. called? It's called Missing, Missing You. you. Yeah. Missing I, I, you. I only found out when I was looking through your stuff. Yeah. Because um, here it didn't blow up. But I, I don't think it even got um, yeah. so that coverage was, of any. I, I so. did interviews in Kenya, Tanzania. Except uh, for Morocco. E sorry for that show. Zimba no, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, Zimbos ouch. will jump on to something that they feel is, is going Chapter in the big, they will jump onto it. But that would have been a great opportunity for it him, right? Have, had he it made it to America, been. because yeah, that was going to they, be they, they want to link you up with a lot of tunes. Yeah, we're, we're going to hear Chris Martin uh, featuring Yasha David's song. Yeah, there we go. That was going to be. And then maybe we'll be. Don't, like, don't, but don't give spoiler alerts, girl. Oh shit! Something is brewing. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you said it, but he didn't say it. Yes, I would like to hear like a Chris Brown. Yeah, but he Yasha sounds David. a lot like Chris Brown to me w when he sings. So. Remember earlier when I asked like who influences the sound of his music? You didn't expect uh, Steve Madongi. You didn't Steve. I, you, you didn't expect no. Steve Madongi. I was no, trying to run away going. from that. I didn't <laughs> expect the folk to told. Uh, to no, the Chris Brown is there. Folk I admit the Chris Brown is there. I realized that it's too much of it there, so I try to run away from it. Uh, it's too much. Every it time it when I sing in English, you, then it could be you your superpower. Like. Exactly. No, but. But maybe the they world, don't want another Chris Brown. The world, the world already has a Chris Brown. Yes, we they don't, don't want another Nyasha Chris David. Brown. But yes, we want a Nyasha David. But have you heard yourself? Do you ever like? Yeah, play I do. Back and be like, Ooh. and I, I do, and I try to run away from it. <laughs> yeah, but it's there. But it's it's natural. It's there, right? Yeah, it's there. Because I can't run away from it. Because when I look at, because uh, I like Trevor Dong. They they did the the song together, the one song. Um, Trevor Dong is very good. I think he's, he's one of the best vocalists. But there's something international about his sound compared Definitely. to. Yeah, Trevor. it's the accent. Cause yeah. um, I remember when I was um, talk when we were talking about like the different genres yeah. in Zim. R and B is not like ours. Mm -hmm. It's a borrowed uh, genre, yeah. and it's sung in a certain way. Mm -hmm. It's got you know the ad libs. It's mm. got my the ribs and the runs. Yes, and mm. the runs, yeah. and also the accent. Because when you're doing an R&B song, you want to sound as R&B as, as possible. possible. You don't want to sound yes. like Zimbabwean R&B. It's got to just be R&B because it's not... R&B does not have a geography, right? What is It's not like Zimbabwean R&B. The minute someone starts calling it Zimbabwean R&B or Angolan R&B, it's no longer R&B. <laughs> it's, it? it's, yeah. it's not... It's like Zim Dancehall. It's, yeah. it's dancehall. It's, it's either it's dancehall or, or it's, it's not. Or, or it's <laughs> you know what I mean? That's, that's what I think. 
and then you had the comment okay. that Cap City said. You you saw that. Yeah, comment. yeah, 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 yeah. What do you think about what Cap City said? Uh, do oh, you have Keith. A Keith, you know Keith. Keith Kuzi. Yeah. 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 Oh. Yeah, you What's see, he saying? Oh, that thing about accent. Yeah. About accent. what was he saying? Do you have it? Did, does somebody have it? it it's yeah, trending. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what? Do you know what? He, he was dissing people's nah, accents. Do you know what? That guy. Um, <laughs> well, let's just say people. Yeah. Are, <laughs> okay, say let's something just say juicy. Let's say people are entitled to their opinion. But I think they should give it when they're asked. Come on, asked. no. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Ah. Give it when you're asked. <laughs> uh, come on, nothing. Nah, so I'm, say I'm something. Not, you know, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna trash talk him. He's, he's entitled to his own opinion, but then no one asked him. That's the problem. Who asked you? Who asked you? You know. Okay. Yeah. And you know, it's very difficult to to take him seriously because if you look at his following, he doesn't have that much of a following. You know, there's a lot of people actually say I look like him or he looks yeah. like me. So I'm not gonna. Okay. So no shots. No, for no him. shots. No shots for him. He's, he's cool. He's but cool. he's our guy. I mean, he's cool. You know, yeah, yeah, he's cool. His he's father was guy. legend. I know. I know. I mean, so his father is like a he yeah. was a big legend. Yeah, but cool. but he went offside though on this one. Yeah, just let the, let the art just be art, man. You went offside. Why? Why does it because have to, because look you know. at Wiz Kid and uh, uh, and Davido with their accents. They wasn't killing that it. the, uh, the follow up tweet that Mudiwa did. Yeah, or something. I think, hey, I think yeah. they're talking about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're killing yeah. it. So let's they're stick killing to it. to our accent yeah. and everything. Yeah. yeah. And you know if the saying? people are actually enjoying, then you know what? Oh, yeah. Why Just, not? Yeah, let the people have what they have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So have you ever had slack from people? It sounds too American. For me. Yeah. Uh, yeah. For me, uh, no. I never had any problem in that area. Because when I sing Shona, it's Shona. All right. When I sing yeah. English, it's English. You know, when I sing Tebele, it's in Tebele. So. Yeah, and, and you can sing and rap, right? You've got some rap songs as yeah. well, right? Yeah. I Did do. you start off as a, as a rapper or you start off as no, a singer? No, I, I was always a singer. But right. rapping, was, rapping is, is, is the artistic side because I can. I just mm. wasn't doing it, but I can. Right. Yeah. And your, your, your style is similar to Takura, right? You can sing, you can rap. And on this song, they sang and rap. In fact, they you rap more on that Ikoko song than you sang. Yeah, yeah. It was, a, it was it was a lot of rap. I just wanted to experiment with the sound and see what happens. Yeah, I'm just happy that people are vibing to it. No, it's know? it 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 is a vibe. Yeah. And speaking about that song, um, uh, there, there was a challenge that this then happened with the song. Mm. Are you happy with the results? What? With, with with the way people are like are bringing out the fact that the song don't go Buddha right. Yeah, uh, and you had something to do with it, according to him. Okay, I I, I didn't <laughs> know. Who did like that? Can he got to go to the challenge? Stop, stop, stop. Because I see I see a lot of people twerking there. I say was Becky twerking? Mm-hmm. The, oh no. <laughs> Were you twerking, Becky? I, I haven't seen the video. I just know. Well, what was Becky doing? Nyasha <laughs> said that you know she's one of the people who got that. Who started the trend? Yeah. And. <laughs> mm. <laughs> 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 I was not twerking. <laughs> so Beggy was I not twerking. No, and if I do, when I do, I don't do it on. Yeah. Yes. So my fundi Hallelujah. Okay, but anyway, <laughs> they, so we did a video with my daughter. Mm-hmm. It was during school, and the car was just a little bit on the noisy side, yeah. and I was like, let me just zone out a little bit. Yeah. Went on to my Instagram and my daughter saw me do it. So I was doing it by myself at first. Okay. Then my daughter saw me do it and she's like, excuse you. And I'm yeah. like, what's up? She's like, I want to do it with you. Mm-hmm. I'm like, okay, listen to the song. And then we're just doing this little bit. Mm-hmm. She's like, okay, I play the song twice. It's like, cool, let's do it. I'm ready. And then I went and then I'm seeing the little Missy going. And I'm like, okay, <laughs> like <laughs> tone it down a bit. Yeah. And I just posted it. Yeah. Then Yasha says, hey, Becky, listen, this is what's happening. People saw the video, and now it's like a trend. I'm like, ooh. Oh, he spoke to you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, all right. He cool. did. And then the next thing I see, I'm being tagged on, on Zim Celebs. I'm like, okay. Whatever, Becky starts as already running. Yeah, no, bigger. <laughs> bigger Thanks, bigger guys, but yes, yeah, so it, it's, it's not like that. But thank you. Thank you. Yeah. So with the song then being turned into a challenge, mm. are you happy with how it's been taking it back to what you had said, go to Zimbo C and then went, oh, it's nice. And then they... Mm. Nah, it, this, this time it's, it's, it's dope. I think because initially... This is the second challenge that he has, you know. Okay. I Mariana, that, that other oh, song. Oh, the, the Mariana, when, yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that yes, one was Mariana. Really, 
Yeah, so and now you it's like the challenge. And you performed with Manamas also, did he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So people are taking your stuff and telling you the challenges. You Is it? That's Does a, it that's count? It's, it's really <laughs> good because now people know this. Because no, I think we missed something on this dude. Mm. Mm-hmm. He's he not a one-hit wonder. Yeah, we need to give the attention back because now they can recall. They 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 recall. To, okay, Nyasha David is Mariana, mm-hmm. but Nyasha David is also Moyemuti. Mm-hmm. Nyasha David is also Jagarongo, and he's mm-hmm. also Ndoda. We've been fucking with this dude for a while. And then now they're jumping onto it. But this guy, you know, he's actually good. And I'm like, good. I'm like. I yeah. told you. What was messed <laughs> up for me was when mm. Mariana came out that song. Mm. Right. The video was dope. The song was nice. But it wasn't it wasn't popping. When it came out it didn't pop as much. It, it started popping out when when the last challenge year. Yeah, 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 last year. Mm. That song was 1 year old. With, uh, but I've, isn't that like the trajectory <coughs> of music? No, no, no. They want to it right off another big he or somebody. Yeah, it was just TikTok. Challenge. Then and everybody, then, yeah, but everybody. Yeah. yeah, but the and song had been there the whole time. Because I know there's times. Correct me if I'm wrong. Mm-hmm. There's times when you write music and you feel like it is ripe, it is ready. Mm-hmm. Um, maybe you wrote the song five years ago, mm-hmm. and then you only release it now, mm-hmm. and then it makes sense now. Yeah. But if you had released it five years ago, it was just it going to be yeah, like. Yeah. A, is that not the case with Mariana? No, Mariana. I had to pay that song. Mariana, when I made that song, they played you. When I ma- when I made that that song, I wanted to show people who didn't know I'm the best. Okay. that's what I wanted to do. <laughs> that's what I wanted to do. Yeah. And then when 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 they they played it, I was like, Nah, this song is dope. This guy is dope. They played it, and then you have don't get But I knew deep down, there's nothing like this out there. There's so what do you think? Hakuna the ch- the challenge it's you know i think a lot of music comes out and people mm. people i think will listen to names if winky d drops something everybody's going to want to listen because is it people because um, of, because they know winky d and they expect stuff from him but he's to most people he's like a new guy but he's mm. been there i think you know the problem uh, he's having is yeah people like mudiwa mudiwa is good but i don't even know one song from mudiwa Nanazi. But he's, he's popular, mm-hmm. but we don't know his songs. Mm-hmm. There is a guy <laughs> who has. <laughs> uh-huh. No, girl, I don't know why you're laughing. No, this not, I'm not. Shot. Shot. No, 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 guys. I'm not just yes. expecting Mudiwa. I'm just saying. I, know. I don't know any of his songs, him, right? But I know him very well. Then, him. then we know. Him and yeah. Her and yeah. Then, so we know his music, but we didn't even know about him. Right. Mm-hmm. Right. So I think. Van Van Ong Switch. Oh. 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 I knew it was coming. I knew it. But I that <laughs> because Mudiwa is actually one of the people who actually then made Mariana to come back and pop. <laughs> oh, you're the guy who brought it back? Yeah, like, no, no, not brought it back exactly. It's like when the wave started, mm. uh-huh. Mudiwa was actually one of the people on the forefront. Could he, right. But, guys, this guy, mm. this Mariana song. This guy's fire. You get what I'm saying? And then everything then started to happen. It was Mudiwa. Right. It was Mudiwa. Victor, I don't know if you know Victor, that guy, there's a popular Zimbabwean guy by TikTok. Two million oh, followers. Oh, yes, yes, the, the one who's based in SA. Exactly. Yeah. It was Mudiwa. Yeah, it was, Mudiwa, yeah. Yeah, it was yeah. Mudiwa, Victor, and a chick called Courtney from Gweru. Those okay. are the people who actually started the movement again for Mariana. Okay. And then it started to happen. So Mariana had more airplay on TikTok than on radio. I mean, in radio, caught on. Yeah, it, it's like Yakazuka foot. Mm. Like it just I can't believe it. Because I'm because because I because mm. for me even before it came back and became a hit, I had mm. seen it. I was like, this song is fire. Am I just the only one seeing that this is <laughs> an, an, a different quality of sound yeah. coming from Zim? And then I would look at the views. The views were, were low. I don't know. Like 250,000 views. Just, now yeah. it's on 1.4 million or Say something. Say thank you for TikTok because yeah, I think t- TikTok is is doing great. Uh, yeah. And I'm ah, you need that fire. At least now people know. Mm-hmm. There's something here because yeah. it's been a long time coming. It's been yeah. a really did you long time get coming. frustrated about yeah, it? Yeah, I was very frustrated. That's why I made Mariana. I was very frustrated. I was like, but I know I'm the shit. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm the best. You just need to have them know, too. yeah. That's why I made that. And then when we made it, Goku, I was just like, okay, now you're me, showing off. Le, let me just show them mm-hmm. while I'm saying I'm the best. I will show them I'm the best. I rapped and I sang on the song, and people are vibing. I'm like, okay, cool. I told you. Yeah. You're like I told you. Like yeah. I've been telling you. Yeah. And there's You're more. Sleeping on there's more. There's, sleeping. there's more coming. There's more coming. And then it's it's it, there's pacha matibeta chapir. 
Mm. Don't be any debate. Shots oh, yeah. fired. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Shots Whether fire. they're still questioning yeah, there won't be any your debates. abilities, there, there won't, won't be, be no need. There'll be no Do need you know, for that. I have a song called Die In Your Arms. It was number one on Trace Africa for like three weeks. Right. You, you got to sing it for us. Uh, but Nyasha, wait. Do you do you have a um, a publicist? Do you have a team? Do you have no, people I, that? I think the thing that I happens. Think, with I think I think he needs to work with Mudio. No, the the thing that happens. <laughs> <laughs> I think the thing that happens with me. It is could be a good idea. <laughs> yeah, I mean, th- I mean, because he that said Mudio made that same mm. song famous mm. pop. So, yeah. The thing that that happens, I think inye guti na dina tunya nye. Like mm. there's no tunyanya around me. Could no one has so I should die so I should die so. Is that, is that the, the the key most of, to most of the times that that's what people Korea. do. You gotta that's what people do most of the times. Look at that boy image. The guy you doesn't know? even drink. Could he? I should die so I should die so. And then you're too clean. You're too you know, clean. No, okay. A, a publicist doesn't mean that he's going. He's going to be there to then clean up your image. It's just to push you. It's just to push. So for the things that you were doing externally, mm-hmm. things that we don't know about, mm-hmm. um, where do we read about them? There, sh- there should be someone out there pushing making noise, making your noise name, about. making noise on oh, your behalf. Oh, yes. that's what you mean. Okay, That's what I mean. Well, for the things that we're doing outside, there's like a whole team that is working. And Lena Mafuma is the one who's leading that because it's now based in the UK. Right, so he's pushing your name outside, out, yeah, externally. He's really, yeah, he's internally, really Zimbabwe, here, internally who's Zimbabwe. doing that for you? Right. Muno Manjaga. One, three. It's like a team of people who I put close, and we're learning how to literally okay. like. Thank you, because I was about it. to just mm. okay, yeah. Yeah. So for 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 people that are here, it's a it's it's a learning curve. We're growing. I never wanted to, you know. I just want to be clean. That's my my thing. I don't want any scandals. Which is fine. I want. Which is fine. No one is, is saying you have scandals. Clean. Yeah, the push is supposed to be clean. Following the proper channels. Nah, isn't it too clean? clean? As, you know, I was about to say biggie. No, it's okay. I mean, it's okay to be clean. Can I do this? Umuntu fungba clean. You guys just want to be tainting and have fingerprints all over the place. Wanna, this could be the next, you know, Bobby Brown. Mm. All, the, I, all the big all guys. All the big guys. Around, they are not, scandals they got. No one is, you know, big and clean. The bigger your scandal, yeah. the bigger an artist yeah. you are. So you're saying I'm supposed to hit a chick so that I can... Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Hit a chick in public and they say, Oh, Rob Scan, oh my God. But I'm not going to win. No, no, no. Too much, too much, it's going to happen. Or something. What was that song you sang at Cultural Night? It was bad. Yeah, yeah. do, yeah. So, do so that. I think he's like a. I mean, he's, he doesn't come off as a, a superstar with lots of chicks. Do you have like one loyal? Ch- are you married? Do you have a, a girlfriend? What's the story? Or oh, you have girlfriends? I no. He's gonna lie to us and say girlfriend. Check, check how he's. But face just, just looking at him, mm-hmm. it's friends. Yeah. What's the story? What's the story? You got a, you got a girlfriend? I'm very single and happy. How's it? I happy. But who could you get one? Could you get one? Some people were saying Shadea, not baby. Shadea showed us baby right here. With all the stuff that he uh, says. A happy he, girl like he you. Has a, he has a woman. No, nah, I'm, 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 I'm in a very happy relationship. Okay, that's great. That's great. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. With what? With God? <laughs> <laughs> you just say you're single. Nah, with, <laughs> <laughs> nah, with the music. Oh yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> right, right. <laughs> Okay. And this is my joke about it. You know, I've I've always heard those statements. I mean, I'm a statement. I'm not a big bagger. One. Hey, as long as I say, I'm going to zoti meri. Okay. All right. Why did you not? Because I'm used to being called a player. I'm used to that. And you're not. Ah, uh, if even if I say I'm not, people think I am. So. Why? But but in the past you were, Shaw. You changed yeah, your ways. Yeah, some would say that, okay. but it has not been scientifically proven. Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you have to involve science to yeah. the whole thing. <laughs> For it to... Okay. Tell us about the new album, Son of David. Songs. Songs of David, sorry. Songs of David. Songs of David. What's the inspiration behind the title of the album and then what inspired you also to do the album? That's your debut album, right? Yeah, that's my debut yeah. album. Well, um... The inspiration to the title? Yeah, to the title first and then to the actual mm-hmm. music okay. in, the, in the album. Well, my name is David, and the only songs that were heard were the songs of Solomon, 
Yeah. Right. It's like, you know, it kind of, it kind of has David's a nice... David's got songs yeah, too. Yeah, it kind of has a nice ring to it. Yeah. And when David used to do the songs, something used to go out, you know, and people used to feel good right. when he played that thing. Yeah. So that, that, that's kind of where I took it from. Because I want the album to be like, if you listen to it, you will know, like, from the first song, you no, know, there's something here. Nice. There's really something that's here. That's what I wanted to do. That's where I got the title from. And, uh, yeah... Are there any songs that we know that are on uh, songs of okay. David? Yes, or it's you know, like all new. You know the lead single. The lead single was Mariana. That's songs of David. Right. So it's Mariana and Doda and Ginger. It didn't do it really well. It was yeah, but a, it's a nice song. It was yeah. really on a Zim dancehall tape. It yeah, didn't Jiri. do. Yeah. Mm, I like that. And then there is Ikoko. Now it's, it's banging. And um, how many songs on the album? Seventeen. Isho. Yeah. Chris Brown type shit. Do you, do you know what happened? Do you know, do you know what I think happened? What I think happened is like, when I dropped the album, that's when Mariana started to pop again. Right? And then... You had to put it back. And then... No, no, no. no put it, it was a single before. You had to put it on this album. No, it was, it was the lead well, single for the album. All right. Okay. Yeah. And then, so when, when, when Mariana started doing the rounds, people never then listened to the album. Because it was just Mariana throughout. Kind of stuff. That's that's exactly what happened. Yeah. But even up until now, I believe that's one of the best albums that came out last year. I believe that. Don't you think like um, it overshadows tracks if you release too many tracks in one go? Because like I'm trying to go through your music and I like 17 tracks. <laughs> Why can't so you just choose 10 of your the idea was or 12? The idea was if you listen to the first song, you will know that it's good. You will mm. want okay. to listen to everything. That was the idea. I put everything, 150% into this album. And I guarantee you, even up until now, if you listen to the first song, mm -hmm. if you really listen, mm -hmm. you will listen yeah. to the whole thing. The Fusion Manguiro one is called what? I like that, that one. one. Yeah, yeah, that's, the, that's, that's, that's a nice one. Mm. Jinjiri got some airplay as well. Yeah. Uh, so, so far, I know like four or five tracks that... Um, mm. That have started doing their thing, yeah. um, but then Doda song you 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 released that a while back um, mm. as a single, right? Yeah, and that's fire, right? Is yeah. that the one that weddings, you the wedding one? Thank, I was about to because mm. yeah. I we've met at, at how many weddings? Two now. Yeah, two. Where he was the one singing for the bride as the bride walks down the aisle. So you know you're gonna have to sing. That's the our outro, that Ndoda song, because that song is fire. You're going to have to do an acapella or that one for uh -uh. us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that song is <laughs> fire, yeah. G. <laughs> and I saw on that um, Olinda um, clip on Zim Celebs. Where it played it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and yeah. The way, I mean, it was like the theme song on there. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the thing. People are starting to catch on to it because they know that there's something there. You know? yeah. And it's been a long time coming. I was, I was, I was getting tired of... You know, waiting, <laughs> waiting for them to come Who around. Who were you upset with, Night David? I don't, I don't know. I was upset. I think I was upset with, with, with fish. I can't point mm. exactly. Like radio like stations? Me. No, the radio stations were playing me. Mm -hmm. They were playing the songs because they knew that the songs were good. Mm -hmm. I, I, I just, it was just taking too much time, you know, yeah. for people to say no. But mm. you know, because sometimes you end up doubting yourself. You, you bring out. Dope That's music, true. and then people ask. Did you ever doubt yourself? No, I've, 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 go I've never doubted myself. It was just a matter of time. No, it was not a problem. I knew it was just a matter of time. I had to be patient. Uh -huh. But the patience is not easy. It's not boa. Patience is not boa. Especially when you know, okay, it's a song you up. When someone comes song, it's a good idea. When you're so not good, aye, oh, 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 Then you know it was just taking too long. But now, now it's really just. Tell us about the money side of the business. Um, yeah. Uh, are you still, are you at work? Because I know you're a tech guy. No, I left work. I left okay, work so you do music full time. Did you ever use your diploma? Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, just a little okay, bit. Okay, Nyesha, let's just um, talk about this two seconds. Over time for right. We had a talk with uh, Sam, Angari manager Watuko. Uh -huh. And he was like, I didn't score, I didn't want. Uh -huh. Right? And then mm. we later don't asked him at the end of the interview, and mm. he says, No, I will encourage you. Mm. You know, at least you have something to fall back on. Mm. As an artist, mm. how important is book? Okay, I will, sp I, will, I will speak for me. Okay. I will speak for me. If I had the opportunity to just do music throughout 150%, from the time I realized that I'm gifted, mm -hmm. I would have done that. And not done anything else. So you regret going to school? Not really. 
the journey now in school then mm. actually prepped me for wh- for where I am right now because now I understand the music business way more okay. than I would have if then answer which So do school that is relevant to what it to is the, that you to want. the area of your gifting exactly. Okay. That's that's what I would encourage. And I guess school also brings out that whole maturity level on how to interact with people exactly. and all of it's that. No bad seriousness, there's no bad at all. No, but, but I think Becky, school is cool, mm-hmm. but if it's for, yes. for, form one to form four, right? Mm. After <laughs> that, yeah. oh, four times six. And then so. also to science and women about people in life, <laughs> they should teach us near it. And it could for them. I don't know what to say. And it is. She wouldn't see anything else is really wasting our time. So if no, like look at those guys. So he's very talented. His parents should have encouraged him to sing. Yeah. Very but age. I don't blame the parents for not encouraging him because there are very few success stories when you talk of music. When you look at the number of musicians out there and then the ones that are really killing it. Yeah, but don't judge it. No, no, based no. On the no, no, you don't judge it. You just want to be safe for your for your. But how, how do you judge killing it? Yeah. Because mm-hmm. I can tell you this. Do okay. you know uh-huh. that R&B acts, mm-hmm. R&B acts, mm-hmm. I can tell you this, R&B acts are booked more than all the big acts you're seeing. For corporates, for corporate gigs. But it's not particularly, Richard. I understand this. And then I'm looking at it from my parents' point of view. Right, My son right. can sing. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's very good. I, I I, will obviously think he's good because he's my son anyway. You understand? <laughs> so, so, so then the issue is, is he good to everyone? And what if he's not good enough? And then I let him, I lead him on this path without a backup. So I get it when parents say you got to do your school. You can do your, your music uh, uh, in your spare time, but let's get the basics in place. I guess so you that only when, have when like it's a backup if you know you're lying to your child to do your good. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. 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 That's basically what it is. Then get a second opinion. Because yeah, I don't know about guys. I don't know about you 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 guys. I don't know about just to be accurate, how mm. long did you use the diploma for? Did mm. you work at all? Okay, here's the thing. Uh, I believe that it worked to some extent because during the initial phase of my career, right, trying to just make things happen, I would do a lot of IT work. Mm. 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 music video. Right. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So initially, yes, it helped. But now, it's, it's helping more on the uh, digital side because information science and technology it was incorporated in races names people digital stores now websites and all that stuff yeah, just yeah. Like, like right now in Indian I, I know how to do, to monetize all my digital platforms I know I do it on my own I don't yeah. have anyone doing it for me right you get what I'm saying so to some extent it helped mm-hmm. but then now the focus is on the area of the gifting no one focus hundred percent I'm not doing anything else. This is where I am. So, uh, so yeah, I was about to get to the money side of things. Uh, are we making a killing on these um, digital platforms selling our music? Is it uh, something that you can encourage other youngsters to take up as a profession and and not do the other school stuff? I would I would encourage people who actually want to do it, to people do it. who are hundred percent into it. Mm-hmm. Because if you're not, you'll just give up by small hurdle. Don't give up. But but look at you. You are very talented, but it is taking you this long for yeah. people to listen to your story. Yeah, but, no but you've patience. been talented. <laughs> you've patience. been talented yeah. for a while. So talent yeah. does not necessarily translate But I think on the to money side, it's not as frustrating for him because if it was really frustrating, you've got two things that you're fighting. You're fighting being noticed and being heard, mm. and then you're also fighting the money side. So I think mm. the, oh, the the money side was okay for the you. The money right? side is okay. It, it, it's, it, it's good. For him, he, he, he's not crying. I'm he's not, not complaining. I, 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 but he's got, I don't want to... He's got a few hits. He's got a few hits, though. He's got a few hits, but what if you don't have these hits on the money side i won't i won't complain because no. being talented in singing and having hits are two different things exactly yeah two different things you understand so unless you have hits you're not gonna cash in mm. so it's it's risky business who writes the songs for you i write on my own all, all of, of them. them all of them 
Apana kana one. Apana. No one can come up and say good. I did that song for Nyasha David. No. Imi baba im. The song you no. did with uh, Trevor Dongo. Trevor did this verse. Yeah, I can't remember this like. Mm. Okay, so, so with, with, with the yeah. collabs. Muna enter verse. I don't want your verse. I write everything and uh-huh. I know so they get the, they get their leads from what you've sung. Yeah. From what you've sung. Cuz when it's like that, I can wow, control Nyasha. it and my energy then flows. Mm-hmm. So it ha- there has to be like a relationship, like a like a relation like on Ikoko I knew Takura was the only one who could do it. Right. I actually tried other people. Eh. Send me more options. Send give, me more. Give me options. one. Give me one person. Nah, I'm not gonna say his name. Nah. Give us I'm not gonna say his name. I'm not gonna say her name. Oh, his name. Her name. Yeah. The child. What's her name? The child. Tell me. No, tell me. Yeah, tell me. So what you said? Tell Tell me. Said no. Tell me. Said no. I've never. Tell me when you said no. You said her. There's you said only Tammy. There's only one. There's, There's only Tammy. Yeah. Oh, oh, Kiki Badass? <laughs> uh, did Kiki oh, Badass know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's either Tammy or Kiki. I'm trying to think of. But the, oh, you, the, you what's the name? Oh, Amara. Oh, those, Amara. Are, those aren't speculations. Those are spoiler alerts that, are, that you're doing. All oh, right. Oh, okay. so but there's something in the, in the works. I watch the own. We can see see these things. We see where it's going. So, so who else uh, haven't we collaborated with who we want to collaborate with and... Um, and uh, are, are you looking at collaborating with somebody from out of the country? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I already did, but I'm not going to talk about it now. I think is it somebody we know? Is it somebody on fire? Yeah, of course. Your fire or everybody's fire? Is somebody <laughs> on fire? <laughs> wait, wait, wait! But fire, like okay. fire is fire, you know. Jenny. Yeah. Your fire or our fire? Uh, can I just flex? Can <laughs> oh, I just flex? Yes. Permission to flex. Yes. Isn't Granted. my isn't my fire everybody's fire right now? But they didn't know before. I knew <laughs> yeah, your fire was yeah. everybody's fire, but they only joined in the fire later. And, and, and you, know, you know, the other thing is when you do these collaborations, mm. Jab Press has done a lot of international uh, collaborations that are mm. trash. I know. Right? Facts. So please, give us it, sir. No, I would not. Uh, <laughs> Judge later down. Nah, uh, me but I but I'm going to go for it. Davido was alright. That song was alright. It was a six out of ten. It was alright. And then it was But yeah, yeah, me alade. No, no. Yeah, yeah, me alade. It was also good. And then the one yeah, yeah, that South African duo. Good, good, good. My figures, my figures, my figures. All the one was fire. Diamond. But Jaquia. Eh, well, 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 well. But yeah, but in general, in general, the collab was of. No, the average. Yeah. You see it's average. Yeah. So are you saying with, we your, need color, your, with your collabs? Is it one or two? Or? No, it's going to be dope. Uh, I just promise you it's going to be really dope. Uh, okay. we're, we're Which part of the, the, the continent? Southern or, or Western Africa? Or Adi African. You don't tell us nothing. Adi African. Caribbean yes. islands. Oh. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> Oh, that's G. <laughs> I, Did you, I, like, what, what's his name? Um, Takura. I saw it soon after... The Ikoko Top Top mm. was released. There was a, another video, yeah, yeah, yeah. Takura with oh, the Trinidad and Tobago yeah. lady. Yeah, that Tobago. was. Yeah. Oh yeah, that I don't, I don't know who that, that 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 was, but I like the fact that they noticed Takura. I know, right? Yeah, we never heard of that. I show. think it's just nice. That's why I asked about um, that collab you did, mm. Kuti. How did they notice you? Because no, it th- must have been this, hard. This Kuti thing. Zim doesn't even know you. He's not noticing yeah. you like that. And then someone from outside. Do you know what people think? Kuti van ama tere music in Zimbabwe. And like and Moog and Heritage. People think that. That's what yeah. people think. But you'll so be they a, do. You'll be amazed, Kuti. Some people are actually poaching music from Zimbabwe. Oh, yeah. Because, yeah. because the because Jamba. Because we don't. Yeah. Then we're not talking about Jamba. You'll be amazed. Yeah. But people, like people, listen, people out there are listening to, to Zimbabwe music. Yeah, but I think the breakthrough that that you need has to be a collaboration with somebody from out there. Uh, you know, it's just that the problem is it's so expensive to get the right collabo that you need mm. because you can see you can tell, for example, what um, the collabo with Davido did for uh, Diamond Platinums. Mm. Oh yeah, Diamond Platinums blew up after that remix of Number One. And mm-hmm. he got David on there, so which means the whole of West Africa, mm-hmm. uh, the Nigerians, we started listening to him. We have a different approach to all these international collabs. Okay. Because one thing that we've noticed, mm-hmm. this has been happening, uh, like there's been a trajectory of this happening. So we've noticed, this is an actually an avenue that is gonna like what 
propel us into the next level. Right. Most of the international things that I've done, I didn't pay for it, and they came to me. We right. didn't go to them. Mm-hmm. You get uh-huh. what I'm saying? So that means there's something that we did here that was right for us to be seen. Right. Credible. Credible. Work so they, to they paid it. you. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You see? But so it's not often that happens, though. For me, it was often. That's the thing. It's being. It's we being just don't happy. know about You've it. You've had yeah. some other cats step up. I yeah. know. I'm, I'm aware of, of uh, the Morgan Heritage. Morgan Heritage. No, there are a lot of people who stepped up. <laughs> so that's the thing. That's the thing. So that's the thing. Arurang <laughs> Yes. So, so that's the thing. Our approach is going to be different, and I know it's going to work because it's been working. But what happens it's is just a matter but of But remember, remember, mm. waiting for a phone call. Um, no, uh, uh, okay. Here's the thing: we're not waiting. Yeah. It's just we are working on what we're working on now, and they get noticed. Oh. That that's where it comes from. It was. It never came from actually waiting for someone to see me. No, it came from what we're doing now because they saw what we're doing now. Yeah. So you're saying there's no need for us to approach anyone? No, there is a need. I'm not saying that. I'm not totally to, like totally ruling out going out there to going see there, yeah. and doing collabs. But it works better. Financially, if they so come if to they you, come to you. So, so when you did the collabo with Takura, mm. what was the agreement there with with local collabos? Ah, you, you, you do you do for me, love. I do for you. Takura is my brother. Takura is so good. So we 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 did it together. I know he's gonna need me on some project. And I'm oh, just gonna yeah, go. yeah, yeah. Oh wow! I mean that that, that works that way. Yeah, even oh. with with Trevor, he's, he's like a brother. He was there. And then mm-hmm. they were like, no, do something. So if there's a like, case that mm-hmm. you want to do a collab with a local Me. artist, yes. Yeah. I'm saying in, in the case that you want to uh. do another collab with a local artist mm-hmm. and that artist says, I doubt that. Nah, I won't. To be honest, I won't. You'd be like, thanks. No, I won't. If they want us to like split royalties and stuff like that, yes, yes maybe. Yes, you can do but that. But it's okay. I won't. It's fine. <laughs> so, so heard, which are the local? I heard you. I heard, well, huh? what did he say? Can we have the shot? <laughs> Nash. <laughs> no, I just wanted to find out, like, I mean, which which people are these? Is it still Tammy Moyo? No. He took oh. us. <laughs> why, you why, why are you on Tammy? Why are you on Tammy? Oh. I think he wants me to do a song with Tammy. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be nice. That'd be, that, cool. that, that, that'd that'd be, be good. That'd be good. Yeah, yeah. That'd be fine. We need to like pay for it. Love Nash, song. you have to get Ooh. something. Yeah. If it comes to life, you have to maybe, pay Nash something. Maybe, maybe. Because yeah. yeah. it wasn't on the bill, right? Yeah. You, you weren't you going to do that? Mm. And, and Rocky or, or people like that, would, would that work? You mean Rocky? Remember yeah. there was a time, I don't know who we were talking to, and we said there are certain voices that just don't work together. And the mother said, not okay, I should be. I should be. Huh? K-Chaps. K-Chaps. K-Chaps? You like K-Chaps? Yeah. Who do you, okay, who, who do you listen to, like, locally? I listen to everyone. You listen to everyone? Every single person. You're picking person. and learning, or you're yeah. just listening to yeah. enjoy? Right now, I'm actually feeling uh, fairly nandy and confused. <laughs> I think if I'm going to confused, do, yeah. If I'm going to do something uh, between Finland and confused right now, uh-huh. the next one, right? Yeah. Maybe between those two, but maybe you can get like an international collaboration. I don't know. That's it's what we need. Yeah. That's what we need. Then to cross international, not uh, regional, uh, not African, international. Eh. You know, that's fire. Mm. Did we leave anything out? Is there anything that you're working on that we do not know about? Because at this rate, I feel like we don't even know you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I'm like, I'm working. I'm like, I've never stopped working. I'm working on a whole lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because the goal is to, you know, what is to grow. I'm not. I don't want to be a Zimbabwean artist. I want to be an international artist. Yeah. Nice. Nice. And Can I know, know and I know I have that. I have no doubt that I have it. I have no doubt that I have it. Mm-hmm. My team has no doubt that we have it. Right. It's just a matter of time. For us, it's not a matter of, um, uh, what, what you call it? How do you say it? It's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when. Yeah. yeah. We know we have it. We are sorting out our issues and we're going to go big. I know. I like that. That's yeah. good. For a fact. And, and in terms of live performances, do you do a lot of live performances? You do a lot of corporate gigs? Yeah, I do a lot oh, of yeah, performances. He does. I, lo- I actually have a performance tomorrow. All right. Tomorrow, 
tomorrow I am at Victoria 22. And uh, Saturday I'm going to be at Longchang Plaza. See, see, the love ballads are the ones that cash in more for you, right? The love, love, love. Yeah, songs. people love love. People love, 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 love. love. The slow yeah, stuff. Yeah, they love love. Yeah, even so these guys sitting there, they love love. They just don't know it. Yet. No, some of them don't love love. They, they love suckers. women. Mm. Yeah, they love yeah. women. There's a Man- difference. Manguiro is there. He loves women. That's where I was going. Viti yeah. loves women. Yes, <laughs> Viti knows nothing about love. <laughs> <laughs> women. Uh, yes. So I mean, so uh, Nyasha, <laughs> yeah. your DMs are they popping? What's going on in your DMs? Yeah, yeah. The honeys. Yeah. The honeys. yeah, yeah of What's the funniest DM you've ever received? Yeah. Oh, okay. Manuds, come now. Come now. I'll tell you, Ziga. Okay, maybe not I, I funny, you but... Oh, no, I mean, you can show, show you. I mean, then okay, you show. Show you. I will show you guys after the show. It's crazy. Yeah. It and then I just, I just... I'm not that type of a person. That's the thing. So I say it. I want to continually profess it. Yeah. Because I'm not that type of a guy. So you're not like VT, eh? Yeah. Okay. And, and, you know, like, <laughs> they, they think because you're out there and you can... You can just, you know, I'm not that type of a person. Ah. So I, I told her, literally. Is, th- is this a public uh, announcement? Yeah, you please face so this so camera right here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Should they stop coming in the DM? Yes. Okay, um, Ladies Pub- and gentlemen. Okay. Public okay. announcement. Nasha David is not that type. You would do no DM and then quick hook up and then you guys just have fun. And you know, I'm not that guy. VT would love this DM. <laughs> <laughs> What a waste of DM. <laughs> <laughs> I am not that guy. Let's vibe. Let's Ooh. listen to the music. Let's have fun. I'm not like I'm not that type. And to keep your stuff. It's, it's refreshing, right? It, Make it you to know have what? A, this sort of a guy. Valentine Jikumba. It, it, <laughs> I think there's oh. I, I think there's got they're gonna be more in, into his DM. He's like the marrying type, right? This dude. Yeah. This is that dude, right? Hey. Marriage material. This is the guy. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, but you so see now the funny thing is with girls, ladies, women—I don't know—the mm. female species. Yeah, we love bad boys. I know. Yeah, yeah. like Nash so. So we look <laughs> like this, and Rino we're like, knows this. Like, oh, okay, Rino no. knows this. He's clean and everything, but <laughs> oh, Nash like, knows this. <laughs> but I'm sure you have it. Yeah, of course. The For the right person, Katril, Katril. I yeah, of course. Uh, <laughs> where do you think the lyrics come from? Oh, okay. <laughs> Remember Form 3, girl. Remember Form, form three. 3. You was taking kids to bed. To bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. this guy was paying attention. <laughs> we we all paying attention to the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> we almost forgot to give him his accolade, this guy. Yeah. Mm. He's the first artist, overall, just artist, mm-hmm. to bring an automobile on stage in Zimbabwe. Yeah, vroom, vroom. Ah, that, that was hot. Performance. Bike on that there. was hot. I don't think anybody else has ever brought an automobile on stage. You took lessons to do that? Yeah, two weeks. Two weeks. <laughs> Just to balance for those. Yeah, because I didn't want to hit Kirsty because Kirsty was like sitting <laughs> right there. So if that power on that thing, eh? Did you write? No, no, I had to. I had to learn for the performance. I really had to take lessons and learn for the performance. You saw that Nash? That was nice. Yeah, yeah, that was thing, yeah, yeah, that thing has got power. Was that the, the first time performing at the Namas? Mm, no, I'm sure that that was your best. That was my best. But that, yeah. my Africans, I don't know if you believe because you know I'm going. That was so cool. That's the thing. That's the thing. That's the thing. It's just that. Paneka kusaiswa kono ngochito on, and then people just talk about the. All these big regular artists, they talk about them. They mm. just go, oh, I'm being, I'm being. they haven't seen anything yet. Yeah. Trust me, they haven't seen. That's what anything I'm talking about. Yes. That's that Kanye. That's, that's, that's it. Yeah. And then when we start to show up, then they will see. But guys, there's something there. We're look at that. On this dude. You know, look at that. Look at Nati. Look at Nyasha David. Look at yeah, what yeah. these guys are doing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, get, yeah. you got the there. names right. You get yeah. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Fange Pana Nati, I'm going to say this probably. Well, anybody that starts with an N, Nati, Nyasha, Nash. Yeah, I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> he's about to say something. I just really wanted to say something. Do you know, Guti, if we could just, if I had the money, mm-hmm. I would put my money on Nati O. What Nati O can do for our industry is open mm-hmm. it so that everyone can see Guti, no, Zimbabwe, no, no, Mm-hmm. Nati O has the capability to do that. Yeah. I would put my money on Nati and Takur. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Those guys, yeah, yeah. those guys yeah. will open up the door. David to go But the problem is, 
think every generation musically but, has but Nati, Nati always always been a very humble and cool young man but Zanzi ane kaka uganza kaka itira loads at the other day I don't think it's Kauganza. <laughs> I, I don't. I mean, this is Lodza. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> I, I think, I think, was, I think Lodza expect- speaks... Speak. They, they speak. They yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. And mm. then what but he was yeah, expecting to do. But I'm going to send a message. I'm going to send a message. I'm going to send a message. But the Lord is very much. So I don't know. I don't know how far it is. But we, li- we love Nati O. Yeah, but um, I think... Uh, the, the, this uh, younger generation is doing a good job. Yeah. 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 Uh, Nati O is doing a very good job. Mm-hmm. Nash is doing an amazing job. Yeah. 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 Because that's why you see at that regress, uh, this regress concert, <laughs> we had to put a petition. I signed it. Oh, you signed it? Yeah, I don't want Jabrez at regress. I don't want to engage at regress. I mean, they don't go together. But... No, we don't want them. But you, you know I, I, want, I, I want this guy there. Yes, and Takura. Yeah, I want Takura there. I want all these nicer, younger guys. I yeah. know, I know. But... When you look, when you're looking at it from a business perspective. Hey, this school da business that job is a narrative. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> school da. The sh- the sh- I'm speaking on we, behalf of we agree. all those people who we signed agree. the petition. We agree. We agree. Yeah. But yeah. even if you signed if I was the promoter and you signed this petition and it doesn't make business sense for me, you will override, I'll no, override your petition. No, no, listen, listen, listen. 5,000 people are going to come regardless of job praise or not. Right? Okay. It's going to come. Rick Ross is a big brand. We don't yeah. need Jab Prez and uh, DJ Remo alone. No, what am I saying? Sorry. Rick Ross and DJ Remo alone will fill up that place, right? Yeah. We, we don't, <laughs> right? <laughs> we don't <laughs> need... In our entertainment yeah. zone. Yeah. No, no, no. We don't need Ja. We don't need Winky D. We need... Yeah, we, need we need Nyasha. <laughs> we need Takura. We need people, you know what I mean, who are in the same genre. I just would have still at you wish about it. But you're being, you're being <laughs> emotional. Oh. No, 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 no. I just would have. I just would have. I just would have. Are, are we not being emotional? No, 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 we, no, no. We um, don't want shamans. We kind of, every artist come, baby face, Japreza. You I know? know? I know. Uh, Michael Jackson, Japreza. I know. I know. I know. We I know. need him on a stage like this. You know what I mean? This is true. Yeah, we need. This is true. So whoever is uh, organizing that, because we we need to see Nyasha David on there. Yeah. We need to see Takura on Definitely there. Definitely smiling. Nati <laughs> Orwa. Yes. And then we're done. Yeah, that's it. So what you're saying, Nati O, Nyasha, and Takura. And DJ Remo. And DJ yeah. Remo. Yes. Okay. Where are the other hip-hop guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, oh, shit, Kiki Badass. Trap Sungura. Oh, yeah, yeah, Kiki Badass. Yeah. What about Trap Sungura? What is that? Who is that? I don't know Trap Sungura. No, no, no. Ah, oh, guys, come on. Every day it starts born, it's, it's, bro. It's Which one is this one? Is it's this a group? Is a person? Tanto Wavy, bro. Tanto Wavy is a I've heart. heard that name. Tanto Wave is on point. I just discovered what, like even Wink homework to do. Even, even well, Becky I mean, who knows Trap everything. Sungura doesn't sound mm, right to I me. Got, it doesn't I, sound got, <laughs> I got homework to do. <laughs> Nash, I'm sitting here well. twiddling my thumbs and I'm thinking. Just try it. Just try it. Danny, just I know try Danny. it. It's really dope. Trap Sungura. His name is Tanto Wave. Tanto Wave. I've heard really the name. Dope. I don't think I've listened to the music. Got, you, you do the, the whole Migos thing on a, on a Sungura beat. What's the story? <laughs> no. I'm not, I'm trying it's hip hop. It's hip hop. Right. Fused with Sungura. Just listen to it. I'm telling you. Which I'm Sungura? Like my chance for Sungura. Oh, oh. I, I don't see it. But <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's like okay. a fusion. It's like a fusion of, of hip hop. and. What song did he do? Maybe if we... like 007. Okay. 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 I'm, I'm sorry. Right. Okay. We'll have to get like, back to you on this. Not on any. We'll have to get back to you on this. I'm not on any streets. Oh my God. I'm not I mean, anything. we're not connected to the streets like that. Like that. <laughs> Even sorry. Becky, who knows everything. Doesn't know this Doesn't one. know this people. I have to go and do nah, my homework. Tanto Wave is hot, guys. It's really hot. I promise you when we come back, I'll, I'll be knowing something. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'll make okay. sure so, of it. So... I think I've I asked think everything. we're good. Yeah. All we waiting for now is the Ndoda song, the yes. acapella for, for the acapella sound, version like, of Ndoda. You know, yes. Ndoda. Ndoda. And even Chavi will be crying. Is there something else that we forgot to ask that you want to tell the people, the fans, your multitudes of fans out there? Um. I I think I said everything. They must just watch out. Yeah, they must just watch out. You must really watch but it. But how about a thank you for those that believed in you even when the majority 
Who are yeah. some of those people? Yeah, Begada, Begada, Bigwa. I believe. Begada, shout out. Begada, shout out. Begada, shout out. Good job, man. Thank you, Becky, uh, for doing All the right. challenge. Cool, cool, cool. Getting let me, it started. Let me explain myself. At the beginning of the interview, if all y'all were listening, were listening and paying attention to what the young man was saying, right. is that it took a lot of patience mm-hmm. to get to where he is right now. Yeah. But along the road, he felt frustrated because he knew he was good and he wasn't getting credit for that. Right. It was always the same names being mentioned. It was always the same, the same, the same. And he was like, come on, mm-hmm. do you mean you cannot see me? Mm-hmm. But amidst all of that, mm-hmm. there were still some people who listened to his music, who bought into his dream, who supported him. Right. So that's why I'm saying to you, don't you think you should just be like, to those that have believed in mm. me from Special day shout one. Out to, the problem with that is if you forget one hand a bit. No, I was just an overall. <laughs> not good to like mention names mm. um, per yeah. se, but just yeah. like, yeah. I mean, you, you've got followers on your page, don't you? Yeah. Exactly. And I'm always, and I'm, always uh, um, I'm always, I'm always uh, in an attitude of gratitude because mm. I know I, I'm not anything without the fans. Right. Because they are the ones who listen to the music. They know I love them and they know I appreciate Mm-hmm. And my, my team, I'm always with my team, and they know I love and appreciate them. I always make it a point that everyone that knows. Know. Yeah, everyone. Everyone. I always make it a point. But uh, in conclusion, um, uh, yeah, of course, I would say thank you. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, my thank nigga. You. <laughs> a big fan. Thank We're big you. fans <laughs> thank of you. your music. Thank you so much for having me, yeah. and uh, more music is going to come. We're going to put Zimbabwe on the map. Let's yeah. do this. Fantastic. Yeah. But uh, you gotta sing something for us. Sing yeah. something. Yeah. Mm. Before you go, you can't just go, bro. Name. You know, cameraman. You got him. Uh, what am I singing? Do that or something. Yeah, do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Sing what you feel like singing on it, because I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Did you write this? Did you write this song? How does it go? Do that. Do that. That's them, it well. okay, it's, right, it's, it's okay, it's okay. Giro, Giro. We need that. <laughs> Shona, bra. <Yeah. laughs> we need that one. We need, we need, we need something. Um, uh, can we just do a Mariana? Okay, sure, that's cool. Yeah, that's, that's cool. All right, that's, all right. that's cool. You guys, you, you, you guys gonna sing along, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah of yeah. course. We got you. Okay. Oh, oh <laughs> Mariana. <laughs> Mariana. <laughs> Mariana. <laughs> Dino Kuda, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Mariana. Ah, Mariana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Nyasha David. Mariana. Nyasha David, David. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Wow. Thanks, fam. That's it. We're out. Sure. Peace. Songa zi down ta up to the tits we need that you this narrative they cheat we can I'm chill out deep is that deep they beat we make you spill a bean if you know what i mean and it's time